Today I'll be working on binary and loops in Swift. The question is, given an integer, find the binary gap. So a binary gap is the maximum number of consecutive zeros in between two ones. For example, um, number six, the binary for number six is 110. And the binary gap is zero because there does not exist any zeros in between two ones. And for number nine, the binary is 1001. The binary gap is going to be two because there are two zeros in between two ones. Likewise, for number 145, the binary is 1001, 0001. And the binary gap is going to be equals to three because the maximum number of consecutive zeros between two ones is three. You have two zeros here and three zeros here. In order to write the algorithm for this, we need to first convert integer to binary, then loop through the binary. Converting from integer to binary, it's very easy using Swift. Let's just use a number nine, for example. And then the binary number for number nine is going to be string number radix two. Basically binary, it's a, it's a number with base two. So we're saying return me the value if I want the integer to be base of two. Now that we have our binary to work with, we need two variables before the loop. First variable is going to be a binary gap. Second variable is going to be temp zeros. Temp zero is going to record the number of zeros in between once temporarily. So we're going to use a for loop here for i in binary. Um, if i equals to zero, we want to increase the temporary zeros by one. However, if i equals to one, and at the same time, the temp zero is greater than the binary gap, than the current binary gap, and we want to set the temp zero to be the new binary gap. And finally, we zero out the temp zeros you will have your binary gap. In this case, the binary gap is two because we're passing number nine. If we pass in number 145, the binary gap should be three. Okay, hope you find this helpful and please leave me any comments if you have any questions.